Welcome to the Chicago Public Schools instructional video for the online elementary school application process. This video will take parents through the necessary steps to request a PIN, schedule selective enrollment elementary schools exams, and submit your magnet application. These steps are for parents whose children do not currently have a brother or sister in 8th grade applying to 9th. If you have more than one child, and one is a current 8th grader, be sure to activate your account with the PIN on your 8th grader's eligibility letter, and then add their younger siblings to the account. Do not request a PIN if you have a current 8th grade child. There should only be one online account per family. You may have multiple children on one account. Please note, we will give instructions for parents of non-Chicago public school students applying to 5th through 8th grade in a few moments. Let's begin. If you have a child applying to kindergarten through 8th grade, go to apply.cps.edu and click Step 1. Complete the required fields to set up your account. Make sure you enter your email address correctly and create a password that you will remember. Once complete, Click Submit. Please note, if your child is a current Chicago Public School student or was last year, please have their student ID number handy as we will ask you for this number as you complete Step 1. Next, indicate the grade your child will be entering in the fall of 2015. Answer the questions, complete the form, and click Submit when finished. If there are no siblings to add to the account, click Request a PIN. You will receive an email confirmation letting you know that you have set up your account and that you should receive a PIN in the mail within five business days. Please note, you do not have to add your children to the account right away. You can request your PIN first and then add your children after you receive and activate your PIN. Once you receive your PIN in the mail, return to apply.cps.edu. Click Step 2 Returning User. Enter your email address and the password that you created, then click Log In. The next screen will prompt you to enter the PIN that you received in the mail. Enter your case-sensitive PIN and click Submit CPS PIN. You will now be taken to the dashboard, where you will see your information as well as the student information that you entered during Step 1. If you did not add a child to your account, you may do so now by clicking Add Student to the Account. Please stay tuned. We will give instructions for scheduling and application submission in a few moments. If you are the parent of a private school student applying to 5th through 8th grade and you have taken both reading and math sections of the NWEA math test by October 11, 2014, you will receive an eligibility letter and PIN in the mail two weeks after your child's second exam. We will talk about this PIN in a moment. If your child has not taken the NWEA MAP test and you plan to apply to Selective Enrollment Elementary Schools, you will need to submit the NWEA MAP registration form by November 28, 2014 so that you can take the NWEA MAP on December 6th and 7th. You can find this form at cpsoae.org. Click the first link under News. If you're seeing this video after November 28th and your child has not taken the NWEA MAP, contact the Office of Access and Enrollment at 773-553-2060. Also, if your child hasn't taken the NWEA MAP yet, you will need to submit paper applications. You will not be able to apply using the online application site. Paper applications can also be found at cpsoae.org under the News link. Be sure to submit your paper applications by December 12, 2014. Again, non-Chicago public school students who have completed their NWEA MAP testing by October 11th will receive an eligibility letter and a PIN. After you receive your letter and PIN, go to apply.cps.edu and click Step 1. Complete the required fields to set up your account. Make sure you enter your email address correctly and create a password that you will remember. Once complete, click Submit. Next, indicate the grade your child will be entering in the fall of 2015. 
click yes when asked if your student received an eligibility pin. Enter the pin from the eligibility letter, complete the form, and click submit. If there are no siblings to be added to the account, click go to dashboard. You can now begin scheduling your C's exam. We will schedule the exam for the Regional Gifted Centers, International Gifted Program, and Academic Centers together. First, click the green Schedule button in the Selective Enrollment Elementary School section. Note that students applying to kindergarten would take the test for both the Regional Gifted Centers and the Classical Schools, and they will take the test on the same day. Students applying to Regional Gifted Centers International Gifted Programs and Academic Centers will take one exam for these programs, and they will take a separate exam on a separate day if they are applying to classical schools. You will schedule your second exam after you schedule your first. Select your primary language from the drop-down menu, then select the program you want to schedule for. Click Next Step. Select the test site and click Next Step. From the drop-down, select an available test date and time then click Next Step. Make sure all information is correct, then click Confirm. Print your test confirmation page. This will serve as entrance to your exam. You will also receive an email confirmation. When you're finished, click Return to Dashboard, or if you need to schedule another test, click Schedule for more tests, and continue the steps described earlier. When you've completed the necessary steps to schedule your exams, it is time to attend your test session. Remember, just because you have scheduled your exam does not mean that you have applied to any schools. By December 12th, you must return to the application website, click Apply, and submit your applications. If you do not apply, you will not be considered for any of the schools. We will complete the Magnet, Magnet Cluster, and Open Enrollment Elementary School application together. Click the blue Apply button in the Magnet, Magnet Cluster, Open Enrollment Elementary School section. Read the information and instructions carefully. Scroll down and click, I have read the information and instructions above, then click Next Step. Add schools to your application by clicking the plus button next to each school. You can apply to up to 20 schools. Be sure to only apply to schools where you would accept an offer if your child receives one. Once you have all the schools you want on your application, click Next Step. You will see a sibling check page. If your child has a brother or sister at any of the schools you're applying to, and that sibling will remain enrolled in that school in the 2015-2016 school year, please check the school, provide the currently enrolled student CPS ID number and last name, and then click Next Step. If this page does not apply to your child, click Next Step. Make sure all of the information is correct, then click Submit. Print the confirmation for your records, then click Return to Dashboard. Back at the dashboard, make sure your applications and scheduling status says Completed. These procedures are designed to enhance your elementary application experience and make it easier and more efficient for you to apply for the schools of your choice. If you have any questions or need assistance, please contact our office at 773-553-2060 or email us at oae at cps.edu. For the Chicago Public Schools and the Office of Access and Enrollment, thanks for watching.